Hello everyone. Police body cameras have captured several UP shooting incidents. Tonight, TV6 has the exclusive footage of a June incident in Ishpeming Township. TV6's Harry Lee explains how body camera footage is used to protect everyone involved. A warning, the following images do contain graphic content. In today's world of social media, we're used to videos of police encounters. People expect to see some type of a recording device. The officer's word uh, quite often isn't good enough anymore. Take, for example, the shooting death of Ishpeming Township man Clifford Tucker in June. Clifford Dalt! Clifford Dalt! Clifford Dalt! Clifford Dalt! Having a recording of the incident protects both the officer and the suspect. In this instance, after the prosecutor reviewed the video, the officer involved was not charged. Body cameras make a good officer better. If you know you're being videotaped, you're going to think twice about doing something that you shouldn't be. Also, from the suspect, if they see that they're being videotaped and this may come back in a jury trial, they're going to think twice about doing something. Though the camera captures the moment, it doesn't catch the emotional cues in any given situation. That matters in a crisis. If they face a, a deadly force situation, you know, they have a split second, a half second to react. Uh, draw their weapon if necessary or take some other action. Zybert cautions that cameras may not show everything happening, but he says overall they're a good thing. Harry Lee, TV6 News, Marquette.